It's more than three months we are waiting for a custom recovery for our Leno K4 node. If you are also waiting for it, then good news is there is TWRP recovery present for our Leno K4 node. So today I'll be showing you how to unlock bootloader and install custom recovery in your Leno K4 node. So let's get started. So here are some instructions you should follow before proceeding further. First, you should read all warnings I shown at the beginning of this video. Second, make sure to back up all your important data because all user data will be wiped out after unlocking bootloader. And third, watch this video till the end before doing anything. So now, download all files and tools from the link given in the description down below and put all files in your PC. Now turn on your Leno K4 node, go to settings and then developer options. If there is no such option in your device, then go to about phone, device information and simply tap on build number for 5 to 7 times. Again go to developer options and enable USB debugging and OEM unlocking. And simply power up your device. Next thing you should do is extract the zip in your PC. Now in extracted folder, there would be some subfolders and some programs. One of those is patch folder. In the patch folder, we have all tools we are going to require in this step. Now open SV Flash tool, right click and run as administrator. Select scatter text from the patch folder. Here you will notice that only preloader is selected. If it is, then you are going right. So click on download button and connect your Leno K4 node using USB cable, which should be powered off. If your device is going into charging mode, then install MediaTek Preloader drivers. Once flashing is completed, press Alt plus Ctrl plus V simultaneously to turn on advanced mode. Now go to Windows and select Wipe Memory. Go to write memory and simply select your boot bin from patch folder. And enter address shown here. Now next EMMC user should be selected and in download preloader should be selected to proceed write memory if everything is okay click on write memory and reconnect your device now flashing process will start so it's time to turn on your leno k4 node again go to settings developer options and check whether OEM unlocking is enabled. If it is not, then enable it. Don't power up your device this time and connect your device using USB cable. Now a pop-up window will appear at home screen. So you have to just allow USB debugging. Now on your PC, navigate to extracted folder, search for unlock recovery batch file, run that batch file and leave your Leno K4 node connected. As soon as some commands run in your PC, 
your device will reboot into fast boot mode and unlocking will start. Just press enter whenever asked. Now some instruction will appear on your android screen. Read all those instructions and press volume up key. After a couple of seconds, bootloader will be unlocked and you just have to restart your device manually. I tried fastboot reboot command which didn't work for me. So if you want, you can try it. And if it doesn't work for you, you can just manually turn your device on. So just unplug USB cable and manually turn on your device simply by pressing and holding power key. Your device will start and now all your data will be wiped out and you have to set up your device once again. Now you have to root your device using Root app. You can install DWRP recovery using ADB or SP flash tool without rooting your device. But the problem is there is one file you should modify. If you don't do then the custom recovery you install will be replaced by stock one after first boot up. So just root your device and install root explorer. Grant the root access for root explorer if asked. Open system folder. In that folder, find recovery from boot.p file. You can either delete that file or extend extension from p to back, which is like keeping backup of that file. So just rename it to recovery from boot.back. Now you are all set to install TWRP recovery. Now it's all up to you how to install it using ADB, Flash Tool, or any other method. I'm going to show how to install it through Rasher. So Rasher is the Android app which will help us to install custom recovery. So just install it. Now in extracted folder, there would be one more folder recovery. So open it and copy recovery image in external or internal storage of your Linux Graphon node. Open the Rasher, grant root access and select recovery from storage. Navigate to folder where you have copied recovery image and select that recovery image. Now installation will be completed in couple of seconds. Now it will ask you if you want to reboot into recovery mode or not. So it's better to reboot into recovery mode to check whether TWRP recovery has installed. So that's the full tutorial for installing TWRP recovery. Follow all steps properly comment down for more help i will try to answer some genuine questions subscribe to my channel for more videos and thanks for watching